Starting a new learning resource with the eLearning XHTML editor is quite easy. To start a new project, just click on File and click on New. Now you may choose a style for your learning resource. Just click on the style and choose from the different styles. Let's say for this one, we choose Slate. And this is how the page would look like. You are now ready to define the outline of your learning package. The outline tool set allows you to define the structure your project will take. This is particularly useful for large or complex projects that contain many parts or topics. On startup, the authoring pane displays to the right of the access sidebar. Let's say for this one, we will have English 1. To add additional nodes, select parent node for this one it's English one by highlighting it and then click the add page button let's say we will add three topics to delete a node select the node you want to delete and then click the delete button for this one we will choose the third topic click on the delete button a dialog message displays to check this action. Just click OK to continue. To rename the nodes, you just have to select the node you want to rename and double click. For example, we choose Topic 1 and then rename it to This dialog box prompts you to enter the new name. Just enter the name and then press OK. This action can also be done using the Rename button at the top of the panel. Just click on the name you want to change, then click on Rename. For example, just the same, click on OK. Now you can also promote or demote the topics using the arrows located beneath the outline pane. Select a node, for example we choose the first one, and click on one of the arrows to change the position of that node with the outline structure. So if you want to put the sentence under the parts of speech, just click on this button or the move or move node down button. Let's say, for example, you decide to put the sentence at the top, just click on this button, the Move Node Up button. 